In this video, we're going to look at how to create and manage personal lists in the ProRealTime platform. To open the personal lists window, click the wrench right here. This window will open the set list window, which will let you manage your personal lists. Here we see my personal lists, my Forex, my futures, and my stocks. If I want to rename a list, just click here and enter a different name. I can duplicate a personal list by clicking here or delete a personal list by clicking here. Let's create a new personal list. Enter a name for the list. We'll call this Forex2. To add an instrument to the list, the easiest way is to do the quick addition. Just search for a name. I enter EURUSD here and then click it. You can also search securities by clicking this button. The advanced search window will open and let me search either by keyword or by market. I can enter a keyword here, for example, GBPUSD, click search, and add it to my list. Let's do a market search now. I can select Forex. forty seven pairs and then I can select several different instruments at once click OK to add these to your list if you want to delete instruments from your list simply select them here and choose delete selected securities from list. You can use this to select all the securities in the list. You can also copy these instruments to a different list. Select copy selected securities to and I could select Forex1 here for example. The instruments I selected were then added to the Forex1 list. Let's go back to Forex2. It's possible to choose a highlight color by clicking here. You can see this instrument is now highlighted in the list. You can choose different highlight colors. Let's unhighlight these now. You can also delete instruments from your list just by using the red cross here. Personal lists in ProRealTime can be displayed in a custom order. You see the number column here. This column can be customized. For example, select GBPCAD here. If I want to display this first, I just use the arrows here to move it up in the list. When the list is sorted by number, you can see that it's displayed first. The up and down arrows can only be used when only one instrument is selected. The number column is one of the columns that you can display or hide by clicking on the wrench key here in the list window. If you wanted to customize the display order of a predefined list, for example, you could select the list, select all of the instruments in the list, choose copy selected securities to new lists, and then copy all of these instruments to your own personal list. From here, 
you could then change the order of the predefined list which we've now made into a personal list and add or remove some instruments say you really like the popular instruments list but you don't look at all the instruments in that list you can just remove the ones that you don't use often from this window it's possible to make a copy of the predefined lists in Pro Real Time and customize those to your needs. For example, choose Popular Instruments here, select all of the instruments in the list, choose Copy Selected Securities to New Lists. We could call this Popular 2. Click OK. Since this list is now a personal list, I can then change the display order as I need to, or remove some of the instruments that I don't look at from this list. You can also add instruments to personal lists from charts or from other lists, even outside of the set list window. Let's open Popular 2 here, for example. I can right click on any instrument in this list choose delete from list popular 2 or if I wanted to add an instrument displayed in a chart to a list just right click on the chart choose add it's also possible to drag instruments from other lists into your personal lists for example let's open a pro screener if we wanted to move one of the results of this pro screener market scan into a personal list just drag and drop the instrument into the personal list to learn more click on one of the links that appears on the screen